Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to um, go over how to create a percent field in Salesforce. So you're going to want to be in setup if you're not there. Go ahead and click the gear icon in the top right corner, hit setup, and it'll take you to a page that looks like this. From there, you're going to want to go to the object manager. And you'll want to choose your object. So this could be account, could be opportunity, could be lead, but we are going to go to our new object that is labeled new object. From here, we're going to go to fields and relationships and click new. Here is where we're going to choose what type of field this is. So we're going to choose percent and hit next. All right, here's the details of your field. So whatever you want to call your field is going to be the field label. I'm going to call this grade because let's say this is a new object that's going to help us with our grading system for school. So you can have it up to 18 digits. That'd be a lot. I'm going to change this to 16 and so then after the decimal place we can have two. Uh, make sure that it always adds up to 18 or else it'll throw an error when you try and save can add a description field if you feel like it'll be helpful on the back end to your admins or help text on the front end if you feel like it'll be helpful to your front users, front end users. Um, then required, does should this be required? And for default value, you can create a formula or make it a default, but none of that is what we have required. So I'm going to hit next. All right, here's where we establish the field level security, which is who can see it, who can read it, who shouldn't be able to edit it, stuff like that. I'm going to keep everything the same and hit next. Here is where we can add it to a page layout. So it's going to automatically go onto the new object layout. You may or may not want to move it. You can check, click page layouts if you want to edit it, but first we have to save. All right, let's validate that we have grade right here. And it is a new field. So thank you for joining me on how to create a percent field in Salesforce. Be sure to give this video a like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And I will see you guys in the next one.